in court. Okay. And uh, this is the, actually the second tutorial on retrieval model. Uh, this is the first, uh, uh, how do say, the second uh, Galago tutorial. And it's about the retrieval model. And it's close, closely related to your lab two assignment. And uh, uh, let's first do some recap of the smoothing methods. Actually, in the lecture, the professor already introduced several um, retrieve, retrieve methods. For example, some smoothing methods, like the GM method or Dirichlet method. And uh, as you can see, the method here typically uh, contain uh, two parts. The first part is the uh, document probability, which means uh, the the term uh, the term probability in, the, in current document. Another part is the term probability in the whole collection. And uh, with this two, we can do we can use the smooth method to do some fast retrieval. And uh, and uh, actually, Galago have some uh, have some uh, command line to help us to do it. So we don't need to implement it by ourselves. Uh, come, uh, this is the format of the command line. As you can see, we need to specify the stammer here, and we need to specify the some parameters. Uh, for example, this one we use the directlate. So as you can see, in directlate, in directlate we have to set the mu. This mu here, this is a parameter. So we have to specify it in the command line. This is the mu, and uh, uh, so, uh, and uh, we also have to specify the index file. I think you already know how to build the index. This is the index file. You have to specify because we need to do the how do you say we need to do the we need to use the inverted index to get some uh, statistics in order to do a retrieval and uh, finally uh, and uh, another important thing is the query file because we want to do retrieval we have to at first have some queries and we have to specify the query this is a query file it contains a lot of queries and this is the, the queries format format. And finally, we will direct it to a file for later evaluation. And uh, you can use the Galago Evo to, uh, to, ev to do evaluation. For example, if you want to NDC, you want NDCG or MAP, you can use Galago Evo, Evo this method to do the uh, metrics. And uh, uh, this uh, uh, this one is the uh, command line version of Galago. Actually, we can also use some Java API to do to do the retrieval. For example, uh, uh, first we need to specify some parameters. For example, we uh, here is an example of the GM method. And as you can see, in GM method, we have to specify lambda. So you have to specify lambda here, and uh, the request here means. Uh, how many documents we are going to, uh, to retrieve. And, uh, and this, is, uh, this is the parameters we set for the method. And we also need to uh, specify the query, input the query. And uh, you need to know a little, about, little bit about the query in the Galago query language in order to uh, know how to input the query. The common steps is, uh, uh, is to uh, uh, do a query, for example, here. Then, for example, here, we want to we input the Apple. We, are, we want uh, the documents that is related to Apple. So we uh, input a query here. And uh, this is our original query string. And we change it to query tree, use this method, use this uh, method. And then we apply some traversals uh, using this method. And finally, you can issue a query. Uh, um, actually, I'm not really that familiar with the details, but this is a common steps for Galago to do a retrieval. And uh, if you want to know more details about this, I think you need to uh, you need to 
I think you need to uh, read more about the documentation for Galago. And uh, sorry, I'm not recording. Okay. And uh, do you have any questions currently? Any feedback? Hi. Yeah, I wanted to ask one thing. Last time to the documentation for Galago, right? I wanted to know about uh, one of the classes, but I couldn't find. Like, where should we go and find the documentation for each of the classes of what? Okay, oh, that, that's a that's a very uh, good uh, that's a very good question. Actually, I have uh, encountered such problem, and I'm not very familiar with Galago. So I have to you know, uh, search on the GitHub and many people, and many people they have their code and uh, you can, you will uh, know which, how to say, which, uh, which one to import in the Galago uh, by looking at their codes. You can just type what you want in the GitHub and the GitHub will, in the GitHub, GitHub will return some results and you can, you will know uh, which you need to import uh, in the Galago. That's a common techniques I use to uh, to do because I also encounter some, such a problem. Sure. Okay. And then any other problems, questions? Okay, I will begin the uh, next uh, next one. Actually, the Galago is a uh, API and. Uh, I don't want you guys to treat it as a black box. Uh, so I, uh, I just uh, extract uh, the results here. This is an uh, example. If we input uh, the word Apple and it, uh, it uh, return a document. This is a document's uh, uh, name and this is a score. And uh, this, is, uh, this is the length of the doc current document. And this is the Apple, how many times Apple appear in this document. And this is a collection length. And this is how many times the, the how to say, the Apple in, in, uh, in Apple uh, in the current collection. And actually you can use this, uh, this uh, the GM method in the slides to compute and you will get this score uh, by yourself. And you can see that the two scores matches and you will know that the Galago are just a do uh, as the slides do, told, as the slides uh, shows. You can verify it uh, by yourself. I already gave you the code. And, uh, and uh, I give you the, uh, the, uh, the uh, repo repository for you to play with just at that time. It uh, can run some basic retrieve model with command line and uh, with the Java API. So now I will move to the uh, to the GitHub. Let me first. Uh, okay. Let me first uh, type it here. You can uh, you can take a look at this repo. I just share it on the message column. You can see, can you see the screen? Yeah. This is the repo, can you see? Am yeah, I still yeah. share, yeah. sharing my screen? Yeah, we can see your screen. Okay, thank you. Okay, let's move just to the, uh, this part, how to apply Galago retrieve models. And uh, I just uh, let me put it here. And uh, here. How to apply Galago retrieve models? As I see, there are two ways to apply Galago retrieve models. The first one is to use command line. And I give an example to you. You can do it. For example, First, uh, I'm, I'm currently in the repository. I first uh, go it to see if there are any updates. Okay. And then I will do the, we can, 
we can just uh, open here. And we'll go to this folder. This folder, this folder contains several things. For example, this is the query file. You can see we contain one, uh, one query. That's uh, just a word, Apple. We want to find the word document or the document that the documents that is related to Apple. And uh, how to do so? I give you some. I give you some code here, some script here. And uh, I also give you detailed steps here. You can, uh, you can play with. For example, we just copy the command here. As you can see, just as I slid, I, at my slide told you, you can specify the new, the parameters, the, the, the method, and uh, how many documents you want to request. And I just enter. As you can see, we have a document, we have a file here. Let's see what is in this file. Okay. You can see this is the word retrieved document. This one is the document's uh, link. This one is its four. And it uh, retrieved, just I mentioned, uh, retrieved 20 documents. You can count it, it contains 20 documents here. And uh, another method, this one just uses the directly method. I also provide you another example to specify the parameters, to pass, to pass the parameters in your JSON file. You can run it by copy here. You can see I just uh, using your JSON file to specify the parameters. You can let me take a look at what in the, what is the what is in the JSON file. You can see it contains several parameters. This example is an example of the retrieve relevance model. I mean the pseudo relevance model. You have to specify parameters like how many feedback documents and feedback terms here. And uh, and. Uh, this is the JSON file. We just specify the parameters here. And then we can just, as I say, we can just copy the command here and run it here, sorry. Right here. Okay, let's take a look. Let's take a look at what in the gonna go on. Okay, it's also the same thing. That's the document, the scores here. As you can see, the scores are different because this one we use the directly method and this one we use the relevance model method, the pseudo relevance models. I also provide you another example to use the, uh, to use, do you have any questions currently? Hi. Do you guys have any questions? Hello? Nothing for me. Okay, I will I will begin resume. Uh, I also provide you another example to do to call the API and do the retrieval. Uh, the code is in the tutorial too, and this one is the Java code Java version of retrieve model. We can do it uh, using the using the Eclipse. Just as I told you, uh, this is so. Oops. Sorry, we can first uh, build a new Java project. For example, let's give it a link. Gonna go to Oreo to we build this one, and you can see this is an MPT project. We can just copy the tutorial or two, sorry. The, this is the repo, I give you tutorial two. This one, we just copy it, sorry. We just copy this uh, to this one. We just paste it here, as you can see. And uh, this one is our retrieve the Java code. 
However, you can see there are many errors here. Uh, it's, uh, it's the reason is that we currently don't include the library. We need to include the library. Uh, add external tools, and this is the library in the Galago. I think you already implemented uh, in the lab one, as you can see. Okay, currently you can see all the errors are gone, and we can run it. Just wait. As you can see, this one we just uh, how do say we just uh, specify that we retrieve two documents and using the GM method and specify the lambda is 0 0.5. And you can see we, we already retrieved two documents and uh, give some statistics uh, in the current document. I think you can try this example by yourself and read the, and uh, how to say, I currently only give you some basic examples. And I think you can, how to say, you can uh, get more information uh, to check the document, the Galagos uh, documentary. I think my tutorial is. Uh, uh, currently just finished my document, my tutorial to see whether you have any questions or not. Fine. Do you have any questions? No, nothing from my side. Okay. So I will, I will, what is it? I will stop the recording and to see you have any other questions or not.